In addition to the many free themes in the official WordPress directory, there's a whole world of premium themes that you can buy from third-party sellers and marketplaces. Now, like I said, free themes are a great place to start, and there are a ton of great free WordPress themes out there. So there's nothing wrong with using a free theme, but premium themes as a whole do tend to offer more advanced functionality and higher quality design than free themes. And on top of that, the purchase price usually includes support and documentation. So if anything goes wrong or you need help getting set up, you've got a lifeline there to help you out. So if you have a little money to spend, a premium WordPress theme can be a great investment. There are a lot of different places to buy WordPress themes. If you just start searching on Google, let's say photography, WordPress themes, you're gonna be browsing theme after theme on site after site for hours. This is one of the most time consuming parts of starting a new website, for sure. Personally, one of my favorite places to buy WordPress themes is themeforest.net, which is a huge marketplace of independent developers selling their themes in one central location. The prices are pretty reasonable, anywhere from 20 to 70 US dollars, which is, of course, nothing compared to what you'd have to pay a designer to create a comparable theme for you. So when I get to Theme Forest, I'll usually go to the WordPress menu here, and sometimes I'll look at popular items just to see which themes are trending, you know, take a look at the best-selling themes. Typically, the best-selling themes are best-selling for a reason, so this is a good place to start your search. However, you can also filter by the sort of category of website you're building. So if it's a blog or a magazine style website, you can find a lot of great options for that particular type of website. So let's take a look at this newspaper theme. When you click on a theme, you're gonna see a description, basically a long sales page that explains the features of the theme and why you should buy it. Personally, I'm more interested in seeing the theme in action. So I'll typically go straight to the live preview right here. Now, this is gonna look different for every theme developer. Sometimes it'll go straight into the demo. Sometimes it'll go to their website where they have a lot of different uh, demo options. So in this case, this particular theme has 150 uh, pre-built websites. So we'll go ahead and click view all demos and we'll just we'll just click into one of these real estate pro let's see what this looks like so this is what your website would look like if you installed this theme and went with this particular demo option you can go back here's another one again this one is largely for news and magazine websites. So that's the kind of style you're gonna see with a lot of these demos. Heading back over to Theme Forest, we can take a look at a couple more options. Let's go to a different category. So let's say maybe technology. So these are some technology themes. We'll look at this IT solutions and services theme. Again, I usually jump straight to the live preview. We'll go to demos, take a look at one of these home pages, IT agency, for example. And this is what that website is gonna look like. Okay, so that's sort of the process for browsing themes on a marketplace like this. You may also find individual theme vendors, you know, as you're Googling and looking for different types of themes, you may find independent sellers who are just selling one or two of their own themes. Um, there's a lot of different avenues for purchasing premium themes. So don't limit yourself to just this one marketplace. 
but this is sort of the leading marketplace for WordPress themes. So again, it's themeforest.net if you wanna check out this site, but wherever you end up, wherever you end up purchasing a theme from, the process of installing that theme on your website is gonna look pretty similar. So I'm in my download section here in ThemeForest, and I'm just gonna download a theme that I've already purchased. I'm gonna go with this float WordPress theme, just kind of an old school blogging theme. So I'm gonna click the download button, and importantly, when you download a theme from ThemeForest, you're gonna to wanna to download the installable WordPress file only. So we'll select that, and you'll see it downloads a zip file. This is generally how themes are gonna be delivered when you purchase them from a third-party marketplace. So now when we go back to our WordPress site, we're in the appearance section. We can see our installed themes here. And just like we did before, we're gonna click add new. But this time we're gonna go up to the top and click upload theme. And here I'm just gonna drag in the zip file that I just downloaded and click install now. So at this point, the theme has been installed and we can go ahead and do a live preview or activate it straight away. So let's do a live preview and see what it's gonna look like. And just like that, we've got our theme installed. You can see what it looks like here, make some modifications to the settings here and activate when you're ready. And that's the process you'll follow for installing a theme from any third-party seller or marketplace.